Okay. You guys got a knife to cut these boxes open with? Okay. Okay, Claire, painted ladies. Okay, begin. Sure. This is our seventh year, but it is our third year at Hearts, and they are gracious enough to host us. They're packed in little glassine envelopes, and we, one by one, open the envelope and shake it very gently onto a flower. The butterflies are a little bit tired and dazed, and they need the warmth, and then they, they begin to flutter around. It's incredible, and they're flat, packed in these tiny envelopes. And uh, we'll be featuring over a thousand butterflies uh, in our butterfly pavilion. It's a temporary pavilion. Uh, this is a fundraiser for the Chelsea Gardens uh, Botanical Garden, uh, which is going to be built in Mohegan Park in Norwich. We're featuring uh, native varieties uh, this year, mostly monarchs, some painted ladies, and some swallowtail uh, varieties will be included in this year's display. The kids absolutely adore it, and we offer them nectar to dip their finger in and hold it up. And they love doing that, and butterflies land all over them, and the kids are very gentle. Many of their teachers have included butterflies in the curricula, so the children have an idea of what they should be looking for. And we do have demonstrations of the four stages of a butterfly's life. It's magical to the children the expression on their faces and one thing that's wonderful the interaction of the little children with the elderly will have a white-haired woman sitting on a bench with a monarch on her hand and the child will go over and start talking and showing that I have a monarch on my ear or something it's, it's really cool Sometimes they don't want to leave the envelope. You have to shake a little bit harder than you, you really want to because they're so delicate and ephemeral. And that's part of the charm. They're not going to be with us that long, but they're so beautiful. 